brilliant. So, Guy, it's such a pleasure to interview, see you in your silver medal round your neck. Um, how did the race go from your perspective? Uh, I just wanted to be, be patient. Um, obviously, it was dead slow. Well, that's championship running, so I was prepared for that and prepared just to, to kick. I felt good in my heat yesterday. Uh, I was just patient and just um, pretty textbook yesterday. And I tried to do the same today. But unfortunately, it's just uh, too many people trying to do the same thing. Um, I love gold, obviously, but uh, I'll take silver today. Yeah, it was a really competitive race. Um, I think the men's and the women's 800 metres and the men's and the women's 1500 metres have been standout events at this championships. You know, sometimes we look at the sprint events, but it was really, really competitive. So I think a silver medal, um, you know, from that sort of race calibre of athletes that we had is absolutely fantastic. Um, so where do you go now? Obviously, you know, you've got second place in the trials, um, still not got that qualifying time for London. Will you have the opportunity to do any more races now? Hopefully that's opened the doors for London now. Uh, I know I'm in shape, I know I can run the time. I just need that race. I need a, a good race, a big race with some decent weather and I'll run 145, uh, no question about doubt. I'm very, very confident I can do that. Once I do that, I'll... Uh, that's all the boxes ticked for London and then we'll uh, focus on that but one step at a time. I feel great, um, I'm in really good nick and if I can just stay injury free then uh, yeah I can get these times, no bother. That's brilliant, it's so good to hear you've like full of confidence, obviously you had a great indoor season, now you're actually taking that out to the outdoor season as well. I think I saw um, a mention of Michael Rimmer, this is his first championship he hasn't made in 13 years, um, 12 out of 12 he's made the podium, so it's very much a changing of the guards, it's you young guys you know, coming through and domestic competition is really really important, um, do you feel that way? Uh, yeah, I think it's good for the sport. It is a, you know, I probably don't want to say it, but it is a, there's a new era, I think. There's a new youth, I guess, coming through. There's even people, you know, younger than me. There's people 19, 20, 21 and stuff coming through as well. So, you know, Rimmer's, you know, he's been, he's been a legend. And as you said, he's had 12 medals here in the past 13 years. I haven't been running 13 years, so I think I've been running about six or seven. So it's incredible. It's an incredible record. Um, I don't know what his next moves are for the next, you know, next season and what what, what it is for the rest of the season. But, you know, he's 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 raised the bar, and so is you know Andrew Asagi knocking out these 143s over the years. And you know, they are people that we kind of they've raised the bar for all us youngsters. So um, it's up to us to try and surpass them now. But they've they've set the bar, and now uh, yeah, we've got to try and surpass them. Oh, brilliant. Well, we'll wa enjoy watching you the next few years. Um, hopefully, keep raising that bar, and um, good luck, and hopefully, you can get that London qualifying seat. Brilliant. Cheers, Jenny.